never surprise your client. That's what most of the salespeople do. They try to call up their prospect without letting them know that what that call is all about. Just imagine you call me up and you start selling me an insurance or any product or service. And I've got no idea that I'm expecting an, a call from someone. Just imagine what would be the state of mind that I would be. There is possibility that I might say no, or that there is a possibility that I might put your number as spam in my contact list. And once I do that, you are not only losing me as prospect, you are also losing all the other prospects that you would be calling because next time once when you would be calling the number would be flashed as spam. It is 21st century. It is important for you guys to connect your prospects on LinkedIn, Facebook, Instagram, all the social media platforms. You can connect with them. You can try to establish a connect, try to establish a connect with the product or service that you are going to offer them, you can send them email and then try to call them. Yeah, there is a possibility that you might not get the right time or you might not receive uh, uh, a reply from the client or the prospect. That is possible. But important is at least letting them know that there is a call that is going to happen. And the next biggest thing is when you are calling, request you not to start with selling your services. It is important for you to first try to engage the client in something that he or she is interested in. Important is reading what they are doing. Figure the, try to understand what, what is their buying pattern. Try to understand what they are doing on social media. Try to connect with an article that they have shared on LinkedIn. You, you, can call up, you can call a person and tell them that I liked a, an article or video that you've shared on LinkedIn and I'm calling you in order to uh, congratulate that the article was phenomenal and then gradually you can get into selling your services or product. That's what you can do. You, you, it, it is totally illogical that hitting a client directly start selling and, and you start selling your services and products. Product, that is totally complete that, that is completely wasting your resources your time and resource i i do agree that your vice president your manager your company might be saying that you have to do 100 calls a day but the end objective behind all those calls is getting sale getting getting value in into your organization so i am telling you that stop doing 100 calls a day instead of that start establishing 100 200 or 300 contacts connects a day try to engage with your client and then call i, I believe only 20 to 30 calls engaged calls will get you more sale than what your 100 calls a day will get and those connects is not the, these connects are not going to give you sale in a month's time, there is a possibility that these connects will uh, create a snowball effect wherein you, you will have a huge prospect list by third month or by the fourth month. So that would be the right way of doing outbound sales. In case you guys have any question regarding outbound sales, we can discuss out in the comment section. You request you to like my video, share my video and tell me other about other uh, aspects that we can that we can discuss on thank you and have a great day